Hello, my name is Pavel Kelnitsky. I'm Flash Platform Developer from Russia, currently located in Estonia. In this video, I'll give a brief overview to Just Touch framework and will demonstrate examples application which give you an idea of what kind of results you can get. So, uh, Just Touch is a sort of mix of gesture and touch. This framework is aimed to simplify the process of gestures detection. As you may know, last versions of Flash Player and Air have built-in support for touch events, multi-touch and gestures. But it's not really possible to use the native gestures, because the multi-touch is implemented this way that you are forced to use either raw touch events or gestures. The other bad thing is that native gestures uh, really depends on the operation system. There are really few of them and they are not customizable in any way. So that's why I came up with this actually quite simple solution where you can create a gesture instances which basically acts as a specific gesture motion detector then pair it with the targets, uh, the interactive objects on the screen and then the magic happens, the interactive objects uh, starts to dispatch gesture events For more details check wiki pages on the github repository So let's have a look at the example application uh, that demonstrates uh, how we can implement this framework. The long, long press gesture, uh, which basically uh, gives you possibility to track the long press. As you can see, the button responds, it uh, shows a glow filter. Uh, this uh, gesture has two phases the long press gesture event with the begin phase. It's fired when you hold something for a certain amount of time and the uh, event with the end phase is fired uh, when you release the finger. For example, here's the text input, the begin phase and the end phase. Uh, most of the gestures are meant to be multi-touch, so I just uh, configure it for two fingers and now we can have a same gesture but configured for two fingers. Nothing tricky. Just one extra configuration argument. Uh, next example is a double tap gesture, which is essentially a double pick. Uh, but also can be implemented in a multi-touch way. So you see I'm tapping with two fingers. Next example, a uh, drug gesture. Quite common. So you can see you can basically build uh, multi-user interfaces. Swipe gesture. Uh, you can customize the desired direction of uh, the gesture to be detected. For example, you can restrict to vertical only, or you can, uh, oh, sorry, vertical only, or you can uh, make a horizontal swipe, or as in this example, you can have uh, two axes, vertical and horizontal. You can also make a eight axis swipe or three direction swipe. Free transform example combines a uh, drag gesture, rotate gesture, and zoom gesture. Let me switch off the other gestures and just leave the drag one. The nice thing about it is that uh, you can drag with one finger, then put the second, and then release the first one and you will still still have a natural gesture drag. The last example is a hold and drag. This demo shows you uh, how we can combine two gestures which is long press and the drag in a special way. For example, first you have to hold this image and then you can begin drag. The 
This is quite common behavior for uh, various interfaces. For example, iOS has this for icons, for the application icons. You can uh, hold it and then drag it to reorder or to make additional actions like removing. You can also implement this uh, behavior for uh, drag and drop sorting in uh, various touch lists where you can hold some item for a second and then it becomes uh, the list becomes non scrollable anymore and you can drag it around so that's it uh, look for just touch on the github and give me some feedback looking forward and uh, hope you enjoyed bye